Yo guys, I'm Fast Fingers and welcome to this tutorial today where I show you how to find the corporate armor. We'll start off with the tactical hybrid glass corporate glasses, looking very stylish with the stainless steel accents on the side. This is the location you need to go to, it's in the very south of the Badlands. It's in between them two junctions there and if you're facing away from uh, Night City then you need to go to the left hand side and you will see this down UAV with a container on the back and the doors are open with various amounts of loot. You do have to crouch to get in here to get to this dead body to be able to loot him. And there you'll find the tactical hybrid corporate glasses. Now there is only one expansion slot on that first set so what I did is I ran away to about 100 meters just so that it it, it despawns in a way out of my draw distance and then I ran back I'm sure that you could do you couldn't you would run away not as far if you was on an Xbox or something but I did this probably about four or five times and then I got one uh, with three expansion slots which is the maximum for uh, glasses. So now we move on to the media baseball cap with reactive layer. This is kind of a simple one to get. It's in the compound not far from where you got the glasses. There is the uh, regional airport fast travel point there as well that you can get to. Once you get there you are looking for the, the mast or the tower inside the compound and i'm just showing you that the is a fast point so you need to go to the blue containers jump over the top take out the enemies if you want to but if you stay relatively to the side then they'll leave you alone but this is the tower that i was telling you about with the antenna on top now it is a bit fiddly to jump up here i struggled at first even though i have double jump i think i went the wrong way you have to basically get on these cement bags and look I fell off and you will notice I have a different gun when I get to the top it's because I got this cap quite a while ago and I saved the video of it but I would, in this bit, bit I was just showing you how to get up to the top so then you make your way around the side once you're on the corrugated uh, walkway get up the stairs or the steps or the ladders whatever you want to call them and you will see on your right hand side that there's a container with a hat now i got the one with two expansion slots uh you can get them with three now we'll move on to corporate blazer with bulletproof lining looks quite smart with the patches and uh, all the accents in it the only thing with this is you can't see the shirt once you have a shirt or a t-shirt underneath it it uh, covers it up completely so this is the location here it's in the very north of watson and then you're looking for that uh, sign there and with a car on fire then around the back of it you will see a guy with a, a machete in his chest and there you'll find the corporate blaze with bulletproof lining Again, I had to run away so I could get the max uh, expansion slots of four because it is the torso. Everywhere else on the body is uh, three expansion slots a maximum. So now we'll look at the breathable reinforced bio cotton corporate slacks. And they're just round the corner from the glasses. I mean from the uh, blazer, should I say. It's right in the north of Watson. And you're looking for this compound it has a couple of red containers in it that you can uh, use as waypoints i suppose and then you just make want to make your way to the posh car there and then you'll see a guy dead on the floor and he will be holding the uh, breathable reinforced bio cotton corporate slacks Again, if you don't get the ones with all the stats that you need, you can just run away. See, I had one with one expansion slot where I wanted the ones with three. Here's another time, just one expansion slot. 
So now we move on to the carbon weave silk corporate shirt. Now you don't get to see this when you have the blazer on top, which is a shame because it looks actually quite smart. So this is the location here that you need to go to. It is under the underpass. And it's in the uh, Haywood area or just on the boundary of Haywood in the north. What you're looking for here is a shop called From Hell. Which I will show you in a second. Uh, it's in front of you and you turn around 180 degrees. Then you're looking for this scaffolding. They need to jump over the barrier, go into the back and you'll see a dead body there. And this is the guy who will be holding the uh, silk shirt. Again, there wasn't enough on there, so I just ran away down the street and then came back. And then look, he has four expansion slots. And there's also some pumps on this guy. So now we move on to the ergonomic reinforced corporate pumps. I think these fit the suit very well. I think they look really good. I don't know what the male one looks like, but for the female, they do look good. Now this is the area that you need to go to. It is on the part of uh, Santo Domingo. It's in the north uh, east. And there is a fast travel point there. And you just run down the street over the bridge here. Take a left. Till you've passed the white van. And come to the overpass and then you uh, take a right. Carry on straight down the road until you see them ballards and then you turn right. Now you'll see some cars here that have been on fire or are on fire. Now if they aren't here, that is because you haven't done the mission, uh, I Fought the Law. So you do need to have the I Fought the Law mission completed to get these cars to spawn. And there's some various loot round here, but this is the guy who has the uh, shoes on him, the ergonomic reinforced corporate pumps. He also has a skill shard on him as well, a crafting one, which is quite good. And again, I just ran away down the car park just so that I could go back and get the better stats. Sometimes you have to do this at least five or six times, maybe eight, nine, ten until you get the ones that you want but it is worth it it really is and it doesn't take long and it's better than saving the game and reloading it it just so much quicker so there was one time where he had one expansion slot now this time he had three so that's all we have time for today guys i really hope you liked the video please hit it with a like subscribe if you haven't and i will see you next time peace out